Norris, will you turn that racket down? I'm trying to do a vlog. Good morning, Kasuki here. It's been a while since I posted, but um, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, it's been quite a, a strange week for me. Um, Saturday, I uh, pulled my back. Um, it hurt like hell. Um, it's just starting to feel better now. It, it's still very tight, but you know, um, I'm gonna. How how it's got to be, you know, it happens. So yeah, today I've got I'm going back to St Albans for just a, as a one off, um, as an escort on their minibus. Um, it's a voluntary job, so it's it's voluntary. I'm you know going voluntary. My dad drives the minibus, and I'm just an escort. I help uh, hook the the wheelchairs in and that type of thing. So I thought it might be an interesting day to uh I thought it might be an interesting day to to do a vlog. Um later on tonight I have brigades. Um and then sort of that's it really. But I thought as I hadn't vlog for a while I thought I'd give it I'd uh, have a go today. So um, I'm just getting ready to go, getting up. Dad will be here in. That doesn't do it with this one. Oh, it does. It's ten past eight now, so Dad will be here very, very shortly. Yeah. So we will see how it goes. Um. So I'll check in with you in a bit. Yeah, the reason I'm going into St Albans today is uh, it's the it's, it's Remembrance Day. Well, it's Remembrance Day tomorrow, um, but they have like a big meal on, um, and they have like a singer coming in. She's uh, so it should be quite interesting. Um, so yeah, they're having a Remembrance Day uh, meal. Then they've got a singer, and they, um, she does. She's a Vera Lynn impersonator, which I think should be quite good actually. Um, and like I think I love I love this type of thing because like it brings them back to get you know brings everybody together. Um, so well, you know, it should be an interesting an interesting day. Um, I'm going to, you know, it's one of them things, um, you know, I'm a bit, I'm a bit uh, anxious because, like, you know, with my back and everything, but uh, I think I'm going to be all right. Um, I mean, it's not hurting now. I've got full range of movement back, but, you know, you never know when it's going to kick off again, do you? So, uh, yeah, I mean, Saturday I, I, um... It was hurting before I went to bed, and then um, the following morning, I got up and my, of all things, I sneezed, and that made it that made it like ten times worse. Um, so I didn't know what to do with myself. It was that painful that um, I, uh, I had to sort of I called I had to I called the like the NHS direct. Um, they got me in with an emergency doctor, and um, then she told me like that it was muscular, so I couldn't go to work that night, which I was gutted about. I never thought I'd hear myself say that, but yeah, um, I wanted to go to work. Um, and then so I had to have the night off, unfortunately, at work, and uh, yeah, it was not nice. It was not nice at all. But God is good because like. I prayed, and although it didn't happen straight away, as the a couple of days went on, my back got better and better, and uh, so it was an accelerated healing, I think. Uh, so you know, God is good. But um, we, um, you know, so I'm gonna trust in God again today that it all, this is the right thing to do. Um, yeah. But uh, 
So yeah, it's been a bit of a strange week. Um, I, really, yesterday I, was the first time I ventured out by myself because um, I was a bit worried about the way my back back was. But I th it's actually better when I'm up and about and I'm walking around. So I'm presuming it'll be the you know that's a good sign. So yeah, and the other thing is I've come to a decision that. Um, I've decided I'm going to start losing a bit of weight and losing weight. Um, things like I'm, going to, I'm cutting takeaways out almost completely. Um, cause I do have a lot of takeaways. And things like the energy drinks, I'm going to stop drinking them as well. Um, and as my back you know, starts to get better, I'm going to start going out on the bike a bit more. Um, I'm determined I'm going to lose some weight because, like, you know, this thing with my back has scared me. Um, so, with God's help, it'll happen, you know. So, anyway, anyway, I've got to, I'm, I'm nattering away and I've got to go and sort myself out. So, I will check in with you a bit later. So, out of respect. For those that died died in the war for me, I decided I'm going to wear my brigade uniform, even though it's a, a bit a, a brigade's end till tonight. I decided that uh, out of respect, because I'm going to St Albans, I'm doing I'm on display. I've decided I'm going to go in uniform just to mark that those people that fought in the war died for me. Um, so, I had a look, smart, scruffy, leave a message in the, uh, con in the, uh, content, in the contact below. So, yeah, um, I'm a big supporter of Remembrance, you see, I've got my poppy on, um, purely because these people sacrifice their lives, you know, in a, in a stupid, stupid war. Um, and even though, sort of, like, and even, even now, sort of, you've got men and women out there serving, you know, and if they didn't, we'd be at war, you know, and so this is why, sort of, I feel quite strongly about remembrance, because, uh, it's really important that we remember those that have gone before us and those that are still serving to protect, to protect us. Um, I've got serving members in the family, um, Ashley and um, Georgie. So if you're watching, guys, stay safe. Um, and so yes, yeah, so I just thought, you know, what the heck, you know, I'll make an, I'll make an effort. Um, you know, and the people, the same, the day centre, you know, these some of these people have been forever lived through the war and know sort of what it was like so this is just you know a mark of respect sort of thing so uh see you soon by 11 o'clock the day was over for the they were prepared at once to withdraw their troops from Poland, a state of war would exist between us. I have to tell you now that no such undertaking has been received and that consequently this country is at war with Germany.
We shall fight with growing confidence and growing strength in the air. We shall defend our island, whatever the cost may be. We shall fight on the beaches. We shall fight on the landing grounds. We shall fight in the fields and in the streets. We shall fight in the hills. We shall never surrender. It's a long way to Tipperary. It's a long way to go. It's a dark claim to Tipperary. To the sweetest boy I know. It is a good It's a long, long way to Tipperary, but in my heart lies there. It's a long way to Tipperary, it's a long way to go. It's a long way to Tipperary, to the streets is what I know. Goodbye, we can get As it's remembrance, I was going to do something a little bit special for this vlog, as I promised I would yesterday. Um, so, <sighs> I've decided that um, I'm going to mark remembrance. I understand that it's not 11 o'clock. It is. <sighs> 
the 11th of the 11th. So, like. <sighs> They shall not grow old, as we who are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we shall remember them. I just want to thank you for uh, watching for that. Um, that was uh, that was my two minute silence for remembrance. Um, I want to thank you for watching, and if you liked the video, uh, please like and subscribe, and please pass this on because I think remembrance is a really important thing. There's not many people that remember it now, so our generation must remember. So um, I will see to, I will see you again soon. Signing off.